hello guys this is Pawan from Amadotronics so today in this video tutorial I will show you how we can uh, basically install pip in uh, uh, in our python environment basically pip is uh, useful for uh, installing various uh, python uh, packages uh, including like numpy and pandas and uh, pi installers also uh, pi installer uh, through which you can make uh, exe from any python script uh, as i had shown uh, in my last video tutorials so okay so we will see how we can do that uh, basically pip is generally bundled with uh, uh, any python installation itself but if uh, somehow pip is not there with you so uh, you can do it uh, do installation separately so we will do that thing uh, here in this video okay so let's get started so how we'll do that so first you need to first check whether pip is there or not so you can check it by pip version so it is not recognized as an internal or external command here in the powershell also if you'll see pip. here also you can see uh, pip version is not there okay we will also see to the command prompt itself so here if we'll see a pip version so here you can see pip is not recognized but if i'll check python so it is showing python 3.10.12 basically python is uh, this is my uh, one more python which is there uh, installed in uh, through mcs 64 so uh, if uh, you have multiple python uh, there also uh, it will uh, create some problems so basically um, i have this python through which i will just install pip so if i'll show you so this uh, so, uh, um, this path we need to copy and i will just check it So uh, this thing and uh, here we will uh, just do slash python version. So now here you will see this is the uh, python uh, we have the latest 3.12.3 uh, which is installed in the our uh, this directory. So I did not set environment variables for this. That's why it is just showing the default this uh, of AMSYS. So now we will just uh, do give two commands in your uh, to install that pip. So what will be those commands? I'll just show you. So these are the things. So first we will just uh, do this command curl. Um, so we'll hit enter and uh, here that get pip dot uh, now uh, we have uh, this file with us i will just install it in uh, in the this location itself so we'll just uh, give this directory and uh, we will uh, all also say no cache directory so if we'll do this i'll right click here and we'll hit enter and it will just uh, get installed after a few seconds so let's see so yeah it's doing uh downloading installing collecting packages pip so it is giving us warning that uh, uh the script pip.exe and uh, and this one is uh, this are installed in this path so we need to add this path so i'll in your case this path could be different so that uh, this path should be if we'll get, get, put it in our environment variables then uh, we can execute pip uh, and check uh, from anywhere if, even from the vs integrated terminal so what will you do we'll just go to the search bar and search add it uh, the search uh, uh, environment variables and here we'll just click on this we'll click on path and we'll click on add it and here we'll just uh, give uh, uh, the path and we'll just copy and uh, now we'll just click on ok and again ok and now we'll again give ok now we'll just close this uh, terminal and uh, we'll just go to uh, the command line cmd 
and will run as administrator let's see and now here in this we will just uh, see pip uh, version so now here you can see now this pip version is there in our uh, this uh, this path python 312 so now we can install all the things are related to pip so here also we can give this uh, this thing now pip uh, version so here uh, error is coming because we need to uh, restart our VS, vs code also so i'll just restart our vs uh, my vs code and uh, here i'm just restarting and here uh, what will we do now uh, we will just clear first and then we will just check pip version so here you can see uh, now pip version is uh, installed uh, here we can uh, see the path same thing um, now what will you do we will just uh, write pip uh, uh, let's say i want to install uh, pi installer so i'll just uh, give this command so uh, as you can see it was uh, actually i had already installed this thing so this uh, that that's why it is saying like a requirement already satisfied so same way you can install other uh, uh, pa packages like numpy or pandas they are using this pip command i hope you like this tutorial if you have any doubt regarding this just feel 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 free to comment us below thanks for watching this video